quiet Sunday morning at Point Cadet in Biloxi, these fishermen clean their catch of the day, a pair of yellowfin tuna. That's way to eat wahoo. It's a good start to the summer fishing season for Sean Clemens and his crew. You just love getting out there, especially with your kids. You know, I've grown up fishing with my father. My son's over there cleaning our, our fish, and uh, so it's, uh, it's just great family time. No cell phones ringing out there, you know, no hassles. It's just, uh, it's just a great time. But making a living on the sea isn't always a great time. Pollution and tougher regulations are making it harder to live off the catch. And then there's the weather. There's definitely danger involved in what we do. Well, when you're out there, there's, there's no pulling on the side of the road, you know, like you have a flat tire. That's why the blessing of the fleet is such an important tradition for the people who work and play on the Gulf waters. The ceremony begins with the dropping of an evergreen wreath in the sound in remembrance of fishermen lost at sea. Father Gregory Barra from St. Michael's Catholic Church in Biloxi, also known as the Fisherman's Church, will deliver the blessing from a boat anchored in the Mississippi Sound. It means an awful lot to the memory and the heritage that we've always stood for, and our faith has always been a strong connection. A procession of the faithful will cruise past Father Barra to receive their blessing. Be careful, Alex. Not that long ago, in the middle of the 20th century, hundreds of boats would line up for the blessing. Back then, the Gulf Coast produced more seafood than anywhere else in the world. Today, only a handful of working boats pass by. The others come to celebrate the tradition in their own unique way. The father receives each one with a sprinkle of holy water and a blessing for a prosperous and safe season. It's a blessing appreciated by those who've made boating and fishing in the Gulf their way of life. I'll take any blessing I can get, <laughs> especially this weekend. I'm going to need a big one. <laughs>